761A is the last. Oh, that one's 761A2. Let's see. There's an Audi symbol on it. I know. This, this one's and maybe a VW symbol. One. I swear to God. Is there a Roman Volkswagen? Oh, yeah, there is. A... <laughs> I think there is. Yeah, did you see this? The Volkswagen and the Audi rings. So you got a Audi Volkswagen shifter cable up on here. Yeah, buddy. Joe, tell them what we're doing. Tell them what's going on, man. Wait, first of all, first of all, we're all reunited. <laughs> the original <laughs> you know, OG, reunited. No revenue. Right right so good. <laughs> <laughs> If you've been wondering where Joe has been, he's still alive. We found him. He's still bought alive. a McLaren. I have no beard. He hates Lambos now. <laughs> so tell us the problem you were having with the uh, transmission. So, took the car out um, and started popping out, or popped out a third gear. I didn't think anything of it. And then, uh, and then it started popping out, and then it popped out a fifth gear. I was like, yeah, that's a problem. Pulled it apart, and it is the shift bushing or the bushing in the shift leakage that is was broken. Yeah. So this this bushing inside of here completely yeah blew apart. So this is the end that goes into the bottom of the actual shifter. Yep. So this is a gated six-speed car. So that's what it looks like when you take the bottom, where and your shifter comes in this way, and then that bushing got. Uh, broken in there so that's why it wasn't getting the good engagement yeah so this is a known issue on these cars either this end of the linkage uh can crap out because it's just plastic so over time or on the back end like on my ra you can have bushing problems there as well so your linkage comes into the uh into the transaxle here so you can actually have issues with uh with the bushings which I had my R8 here, this bushing right there popped out. So we, and they sell bushing rebuild kits for this. So this is what initially what I thought was a problem with Joe's car, but it ended up being on the other side uh, where the actual shifter's at. Oh my God. Is it that one? Well, nope, that one. So it's this yep. one? Okay, now we know which one it is. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the outside one. <laughs> it's the hard one, one, is it? Yeah, it's, it's, I mean it's just a little bit more tucked in there, so we just need to oh, pop. It's not, it's not yeah, bad. so we just need to pop it off there. I mean, really, this easy in the Cayman. Yeah, so we just at least I mean we get to it, we don't have to yeah. take anything because normally your uh, yeah. exhaust is here, which is big in the way if you have stock exhaust. Plus, there's a big um, uh, cover that goes over it, and there's a little metal bracket that holds it on like you deep down in there. That's heavy. Interesting, let me just figure out and pop that off. Damn, bro. Is this Allen big enough? What are you doing with this uh, thing? I think that is for, I think we got that for the wheel, the wheel hubs. Oh yeah, Remember? oh yeah, 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 when we did the- uh, It's a two wheel drive conversion. Yeah, the two wheel. <laughs> yeah, I forgot we need a 17 millimeter Allen. This is organized AF. Organized <laughs> AF. Where are them screwdrivers at? Uh, Just in case you want to brush your teeth. Just a big flat would be yeah. nice. Are we doing this today, too? Fuck, dude. There's no way we Th do this. That takes too long. I know that that takes forever. This is the biggest screw. Give me the biggest screwdriver you got. <laughs> 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 this will be an uh, upcoming is, future is, video. Yeah. Future project. So these Captain Lee pipes for the C50S. So these are normally where your uh, catalytic converters go. I mean, those things are hot. It's hot. We're doing the muffler too. Are we doing the muffler too? Woo! That we could do today. I don't know. Would it really make that big of a difference? I doubt it. Yeah. Just for, just that piece. Just so you can say yes, you, you did it. Does yeah. yours have the? Uh, Mine has sport exhaust. I was about to say yeah. You think I should just pop it, like get it to pop off like that? Like pry you it off? them off? No, just this one. I was just showing that one for, uh, just to ask you the question. But you think I should just get this in there to pop it off? Yeah, she just pop it off. That's how I got it off. I scared. I mean, worse that happens, I break Joe's car. I should just use it. Put it back down there and now yeah. I edit. The power of editing. I don't know. Really? <laughs> that's your. <laughs> that's the solution. <laughs> Certified Lambo tool right here. <laughs> uh, give me some uh, pliers. 
needle nose and adjuster pliers. I can't even see what you're doing. All right, so this is the other end of the shift linkage. So we just had to get this clip off here. So once that clip comes off, then you can pull the shifter linkage out. So this is actually the base of the shifter that goes into the car. You can see the shift knob up there. So this end is the bushing that actually broke. So, but once we pull that clip out, then we just get the cable out on this end. It runs down back to the transaxle, then we can pull it out and swap the cable. It's getting hung up on something. You're not already pulling on it? Yes. Yeah, I think I can probably pull it through. Man, that thing's tight underneath. It's like the cam cover. I think I can just pull it all the way out, you know? I don't, I don't think so, dude. Well, because I'm pulling it this way, it's gonna go out behind there. It's a good reenactment on how it's gonna go. I don't think that's how it's gonna go. <laughs> that's not how it's gonna go. Right, I'm just gonna Hang on, it. let me. <laughs> Amateurs. Dude, it's, the hole isn't big enough. We gotta unscrew this thing, I think. Hang on. Can I pull it? I'm pulling it back. It's coming back. I think, I think it needs to go the other way. You either need to push I it through the thing. Dude, you, it's too big to go through the, the thing. Don't twist that. Man, they Don't twist this? Yeah, because we want to know the adjustment of it. Oh, fuck. Have you been twisting fuck. it? Fuck. Because I can see this part right here. On we the, gotta on the undo part. this entire. No, we can just pull it through it. Bro, on it's the, too on big. It's it too won't big. go through it. Yes, I'm pretty sure it won't go through it. I remember <laughs> now. I remember how to do it now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. So to take this end off, you just. Pull it there. Oh my God! Slid right through the hole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot. Now I remember, and I remember how to adjust it too. So it's been a minute since I did this. It's been two years. All right. Yeah. It's through the hole now. So now I can just pull it out. Yeah. Underneath, then we just have to snake that one through. There we go. This is gonna be weird. Yeah, interesting. Though. That's. They changed that. It does look different. And look how this this is. Different too. There's an update. Hopefully it fucking fits. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's definitely like tighter than, than that one. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> I forgot that's how it works. Here's my question. Could you just took that off and not worry about it? Yeah. Why do we take it all the way out the car though? What this? Yeah. Why, why would we just take that end off and put it on the new one, old one? Oh, because that end is the end that broke. Oh, okay. Yeah, this broke, yeah. then, yeah. Yeah, I was like, what, what are we doing? pop it off, yeah. we wouldn't have to take the cable off, but that's what we were saying. If this unscrewed, if this were to unscrew, then we could have unscrewed this end and just replaced it there, because the bushing is inside. Yeah. It's inside Pressed there. inside there. So, and you can see the bushing, it broke and fell out of there. Oh, okay. So, and there's no way to swap just this end to get the whole cable. So for what's probably amounts to 10 cents worth of plastic ends up being, how much was this cable? For $100. <laughs> the Lambo tax, man. And it looks like, it definitely looks like this needs to go on a certain way. I would assume, or, I would assume, I would assume that goes that's on the top. Is there any numbers? Because it's like anything? beveled. But see how that's flat? Like, well, there's a number there. Well, we can look on the picture you sent and see, does that one have a number on it too? Because then we'll know which side is which. Of course, this one doesn't have the number. No. <laughs> <laughs> right, it won't be that easy. I, I, I'm pretty sure it's only going to be able to go in that one way. One way, yeah. yeah. The, the thicker end. Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. All right. Genius. We're geniuses. Genius. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this, like, cause I gotta go up and like under the motor. I know, I'm gonna try and feed it. I know. Okay. I'm gonna try and feed it. I mean, I don't know what other. Uh, this is probably be a lot easier if we were on a lift. <laughs> well, Joe, let's go. I get right. It's just tight, the whole area that it's going into here. It's just so.
<laughs> Answer <laughs> destroyed. My fingers hurt. Uh, we got it. Well, not, we're not done yet, but it's through the thing. So hopefully that's the hardest part. Center, the, uh, the shifter. Center, the shifter. Open the top up. Yeah, got a little rain going on. Boom. <laughs> All right, what's the what's the pro tip? Uh, pro tip oh, for do for fixing. The you were walking out like you knew you were gonna tell us something. Yeah, for the adjustment on this is what you do is you open these clips up on both sides. You open these clips and uh, and then you center the shifter in neutral and then you lock the clips back in place and that's 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 adjusted. So that's it. these cables, yeah, these cables stretch and it's real easy to. To do it again, you just put it in neutral. Oh, then, you let it because it'll put it. it yeah. puts the cable exactly where it needs to be. Yeah. You know. <laughs> so Patrick lost the clamp. The clamp holds lost on the, itself. <laughs> yeah. So. Me. Certified Lambo technique. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I see. I think I see it. Ah! <laughs> Success. <laughs> Uh, this is how you kill 20 minutes on a job. Yeah. Yep. This pops off and you can't find it, and it takes three dudes standing. It's all right, just charge the customer. It's <laughs> <laughs> flag hour. It's flag minutes. hour here. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> I'm just putting this little bracket thing back on here. Are you recording? Yeah, now I gotta edit that part out. Okay. Oh. Hey, Joe, remember that one time we were in this car and you were eating fast food and you wouldn't let me drive while you were eating? Yeah, I remember that. Because I don't trust you. Wow! <laughs> you only know how to drive e-gear. You don't know how to drive six speed. I have a six speed. I had. I had two six speeds. The key word here is had. You don't remember what it's like. You do it. You don't want to be responsible. No, that bushing breaks. Yeah, that's a good point. I'm like, sorry about your new cable, bro. <laughs> it was a good run. It's a good run. run. Later. Later. Organized. What's this? Is this hard thing? Plastic dip it? Yeah, well, plastic dip it. <laughs> Dude, I swear to God, we got a little thing done before you left. Did you look through these? Yes, things? I looked through those. Oh, right here. Penetrating lubricant. Penetrating lubricant. Royal purple, penetrating lubricant. Royal purple, penetrating lubricant. We're so close to the finish line. It actually wasn't that bad. Like, rather do it again. It was actually worse than the Cayman. Uh, dang, Joe. Why are you so nosy? Look at Joe's organizational skills. Holy crap! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, close that. Oh, God. I keep that closed too. What wheel is in there? Hey, don't look in there! <laughs> <laughs> what wheel is in there? Dude, I got wheels for days in there. Hey, you could never get to them. It'd take like 16 days to clear that out. I got factory Gyro wheels, I've yeah. got Lexus wheels. Weird. This whole thing has been Joe does it for like 20 minutes. Shut up, I got the cable through the thing. <laughs> he does it for 20 minutes and I swoop in and I finish the job for him. You're welcome. All that working still doesn't let you drive it. Where's the tapper? <laughs> I know, dang! Where's the tapper? Where, where'd you put it? Uh -huh. <laughs> Did you go under there with it? Oh, it's over here. That's up. Uh, hold on. This, my friends, is called a tapper. Yeah, the tapper. Uh, here you go. Here's your 16 ounce rubber mallet. A uh, juke sound anywhere. Yeah. He's got a license, uh, custom license plate, too. Shout out to Andrew. I thought that was him. Turns out it's not. All right. I don't see any other way it's going to go on, but he's literally like through. Hold the shifter. <sighs> Okay, I'm in. Hey, let Patrick do it. He's stronger. Yeah, let me do it. I got him on there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good. Oh, Mark, my pull, God. Pull him out, Are you in the car? I'm in the car. Okay, just stay there. Dude. Watch you go right, at, right in for Patrick. Bro, if he pops it in, I'm going to be fucking so pissed. <laughs> Uh, I, I just learned not to fight it anymore. That's just go toward the back a little bit. That's a superpower. Go a little bit uh, more back. 
Uh, no, forward. Oh, back just a hair. Okay. All right. It's on it perfectly. So now we just need the clip. Dude, why didn't I think about that in the first place? I don't know. So Patrick put a 15 inch, I mean 15 millimeter deep socket on to get the bushing on. Yeah. So basically, here, let me see that. I just put the socket on there, tapped it on home. That was all it took. Yeah. So now feel the sh it should shift it now. Like it may, it may be messed up, but oh, it needs to be adjusted yeah, big this time. Is probably all. Yeah. It's not going anything north. No odd numbers for you, pal. Well, I had no odd numbers before, so. You had no evens either. I had evens. Oh, for real? Yeah, I could, I could go first to second and fourth and sixth. Move it, it now. Was, it was the, I'm, I think it's Adam here somewhere. Okay, hold on. That doesn't sound good. It sounds horrible. Because it it's way out of whack on the back. Here, move the, sh move the shifter. Just slowly, one way, like forward or backward. All right, now go the other way. That's back. Yeah, go more. Can it go more? I can't. Is that all the way? There we go. There we go. That's okay. Third. That seems cl much closer to where it was. What'd you do? Okay, I just pulled the clip and then let it. Oh. The thing slide yeah. Okay. There. I got you. It was on it like, like that, and it needs to be like way deeper. Oh, seated. Yeah. Yeah. It's going through all these. Okay. Yeah, it was just way off. Because it was literally like right here, and uh -huh. I needed it to be like right there. Because that's what it looked like before. Okay, so now we just need to do the adjustment then. So everything's done under here. Clip, we need to clip down here. Yeah, so, so yeah, put that clip back on, then you put that bottom thing, thing back on. Yep. All right, so now the only thing that's left is adjusting the shifter cable so it's done on the transaxle side. So it's real simple. Essentially, you just pull this back here and then you turn it to lock it. If I can do it. Okay, so, you, I mean, this is the old one, so it's in the car. And then you put the car into neutral position, which will align exactly. <laughs> which puts it where it needs to be. Dang, working over here. And then you just uh, slide that and it locks back into place. Patrick, I'm so proud of you. You've come such a long way the last time you did a video where you were humping everything. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Sticking your tongue My out, acting like an idiot. All right, Patrick. So we're done with it. It's it's easy. Done. It's easy. It's done. So now we're going to go dry it, make sure we got it adjusted properly. Yep. And uh, that's it, man. That's it. Thanks, buddy. Go team. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> All right, so...